From the China Daily, Chinese authorities say they've deported about 200 foreigners this year. Now, the country's immigration agency says that's because most of them allegedly entered China illegally. They add the foreigners held illegal visas or were illegally employed. Reports say most of the deported foreigners were from developing countries. They came to China for work or were traveling through China to illegally enter other countries. Reports also say authorities intercepted some foreigners at airports after discovering they were holding fake visas or passports. Now, in some cases, the foreigners were allegedly using another person's identity card or information. Now, Chinese exit entry rules state that foreigners are not allowed to come into China within five years if they've been deported for unqualified or illegal certificates. And the question of when a foreigner wrongdoer or criminal can return to China depends on specific court judgments. Now, a security expert says some foreign criminals will be deported after serving their sentences in China. In April, a man from Saudi Arabia sexually assaulted a Chinese woman in public in Changsha, the capital of Hunan province. The man was detained after witnesses seized him and notified the police. Reports say he confessed to the assault and was sentenced to five years in prison for attempted rape and will be deported after serving his sentence. Now, earlier this month, a foreigner knocked over a woman with his motorbike. Initially, it was reported that the woman had intentionally thrown herself in front of the foreigner's motorbike to extort money from him. But further police investigation concluded that the man had violated traffic rules. It was also revealed that both he and his father were illegally working in China.